What's up nail fiends? Welcome back to my channel and welcome to day number six of my 12 days of Christmas series. So in today's video we're actually doing a little bit of a different video. So this wasn't one I originally planned to be part of my Christmas series but today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my friend swap that I did with the very lovely Danielle over at Next Level Nails. She got in touch with me a couple of months before Christmas and asked if I would like to exchange some nail art products with her, do a little bit of a collab and I was like hell yeah why the hell not so we basically planned it for about a month ago but both of us had crazy stuff going on in our life at that time so my parcel arrived near christmas time so what i decided to do was instead of doing a separate video and just basically cutting off my christmas series that i would forgo one of the nail art designs and show you guys what i got in this swap so i was blown away and i can't wait to share everything with you guys so if you would like to see what i got then just keep on watching so guys diving right in with this awesome box of goodies and i am so excited to share them with you so obviously what i'm going to do is just go ahead and pull out bits as i go so the box isn't actually bang smack right in the middle of my video because it was massive and it took up a hell of a lot of space so obviously as you can see the first thing that i pulled out of the box was this absolutely gorgeous christmas card i'm not going to read it to you guys i kept that bit for myself but i did want to share with you the picture that her gorgeous daughter did for me so yeah i will be framing this one and hanging it up in my nail studio my nail nook type situation i absolutely love it i thought it was such a cute little touch and absolutely warmed my heart so as you can see guys this box of goodies was jam-packed so i'm just going to pop this to the side and pull them out as i go along and share with you everything she kindly sent me so moving on with the very first parcel that I pulled out of that box and it is this orange polka dot one. So I am just going to go ahead, take my scissors and snip it open. But before I dive in to what's actually inside, I did want to say that although this was just a kind of like a friend swap, we did say that we wanted to try and get each other products that we could only get in like, like that I couldn't get here in the UK. And I would try and get her products that she couldn't get over in the US. So when I opened this first parcel, I was absolutely over the moon. She she got me um, basically like a full set of the Ugly Duckling acrylic. So I got um, two of their core powders and one of their colours. So the first one she got me was obviously the clear acrylic. Um, again, like I said, there is a UK stockist here for um, Ugly Duckling, but it is really difficult to get a hold of here. I have wanted to try their products for the longest time. So when I saw this, I was absolutely over the moon. So next up, we have a coloured acrylic. This one is a really beautiful sort of like black um, greyish type of colour again I have got a design coming up with these so I haven't swatched any of the products because I was basically just opening them to share them with you guys so I got that coloured acrylic and then the next one I got was one of their other core acrylics and it's called Foo Foo Pink and is obviously more of like a covered pink colour absolutely gorgeous and I was over the moon with them so moving on with the next parcel that was inside this orange bag and we have this one here so again just opening it up and inside i was blown away once again so she went ahead and sent me some young nails acrylic again i have never tried the products before they are available in the uk but they aren't very popular in the uk if that makes any sense so you don't really see them quite often again she got me two she got me frosted pink and she also got me the clear so i basically have both to get started right away so the next bundle of goodies I got was this polygel kit from a brand called Barano. I have never heard of the brand and never tried them, so I am so excited about these. They kind of remind me of like the Model 1 set that you get, you know, with lots of different colours in the really handy little tubes. I love the Model 1's polygel kit, so if this is similar to that, I will be absolutely over the moon. So like I said, guys, you do get the box of um, like the dual forms and then you get a few different kinds of polygel. So first we have the white one this is basically just your solid white poly gel and then they do offer a couple of different ones so this one is called magic fuchsia and then we have magic orange now i'm not sure if these are maybe like um do you know ones that change color with hot or cold or something like that because like i said i've never used the product and i've never heard of them so i will have to do a little bit of research about those but then we got a pink one next up we have light apricot 
then the next poly gel is another solid colour. This one is called Soft Pink. And then finally for those, we also have the Nude one. So again, huge range of colours in this kit and I'm so excited to try it. So next up guys, we have some Glitter Bells acrylic. Now, when I opened these, I was freaking over the moon. I have been slowly accumulating my collection of Glitter Bells and none of these were in my collection. So I was so freaking happy, so thankful, and I was just over the moon with them. So the first one I got was called Enchanted Fairy, which is that gorgeous green one that you saw there. And then next up, we have Fantasia, which literally catches my eye every time I'm on the Glitter Bells website. And I just never add it to my basket i don't know why so when i saw this i literally screamed like a little girl i am so freaking pleased to have this in my collection then the next one we have is another one that i do not have surprisingly this one is called neon fuchsia shimmer i actually have a really bright pink one which i think is called barbie candy so this one i am so thankful to have as well it is absolutely gorgeous then next up we have another glitter bells acrylic this time it's one again i have not seen anywhere i didn't even know that this one existed so this one is called tiffany teal and guys this is the perfect tiffany color i absolutely freaking adore it and when it comes to greens or blues or anything like that this is definitely what i would gravitate towards in the green sort of scale of things i am in love with it then lastly for the Glitter Bells acrylic, we have another sort of like greeny bluey type colour. This one is called Mermaid Tears, another one that I haven't seen before. I am absolutely in love with the colour of it though. Can't wait to swatch it and I can't wait to see what it looks like on the nail. So moving on guys and the next few items I have are from another brand that I have never heard of. This is from e -Nail Couture. Although I have heard of them slightly through the grapevine, they are not available in the UK and I haven't tried any of their products. So the first one that she got me was this gummy gel. I wasn't too sure what it was to be perfectly honest with you guys. So I did have to go and investigate and it's actually a gel for adhering your crystals and bling to your nail. Which is super handy since you guys know I love my bling and then she also kindly sent me some more of their little products as well i absolutely love the packaging of these they're so freaking cute and like i say i have never tried them before so i'm so excited to give these a go so we have a couple of acrylic powders this one um i, I don't think they actually have names or stuff like that on them but if i'm able to find nail the, the proper names i will leave them linked down below but this one is a black acrylic powder then next up we have princess pink which i'm assuming is one of their cover powders and this one looks like it's going to be a really beautiful sort of light and nude color again i am not 100 percent sure of what's actually going on here but i will definitely be doing a video coming up in the future where i will be using these on a specific nail design so you guys will see the colors and things like that then and then I also got Eternal Beige, which again, I am assuming is one of their core powders. And this one looks like it's definitely more of a stronger cover nude. And then last up for e -Nail Couture, we have one of their pudding gels. And I wasn't too sure what this was again. So I went investigating and they are basically just glitter gels. This one is right up my street. If I had to go on their store and pick one myself, I would most definitely pick this one. It is such a gorgeous, like, antique gold colour. And you guys know I love my old style gold gels. They just make beautiful nail art for every season. And this one is absolute perfection. So guys, the next few items that Danielle kindly sent me and the next lot that I pulled out of the box were some brushes. So she absolutely amazingly sent me first the Burano brush that matches the Poly Gel kit. Super excited to have that one. And then she also sent me two acrylic brushes. So the first one is an E-Nail Couture one that obviously matches the acrylic that she sent. I have never tried this brand before. I'm assuming it's a size 8 or a size 10. I cannot wait to use this. It looks freaking ace and it is really beautiful with all those little jewels at the bottom and then she so kindly sent me a glitter bells at number 10 acrylic brush i've never tried these brushes before they were always sold out here in the uk so i can't wait to try this and i cannot believe that she added this i am so bloody grateful 
So guys, moving on and the next parcel that I've pulled out of this never ending box is some of these hand creams. So yeah, I go through hand creams like nobody's business. I'm applying them to my hands all day, every day. So I am absolutely excited about these. She brought, uh, sorry, she sent me two different scents. This first one in this pink uh, tube here is lavender then she sent a more festive one that is called frosted berries i believe but yeah i just had to have a little smell of it it smells freaking ace and i can't wait to give it a go then the next item I pulled out of this box was one of these little LED torches. You guys know I love my LED torch. I have one from um, Upper Cheek Beauty. It is one of the best things I've bought. So the fact I have another one is just so exciting to me. They are so handy and I definitely think everyone needs one in their collection if they're applying things like the appray system or stuff like that. It's so much easier to use the little torch than the ones you get with those kits. So next up, she also sent me some of these finger rests, which is so freaking handy considering mine has just literally disappeared. I don't know where it is, so I am over the moon with these as well. Then she also sent me some of these nail forms. I'm not 100% sure what the actual brand of these forms actually are, but I love the look of them and they do look like they could offer different lengths. Then she sent me some of these disposable nail art mats, which is so handy considering you guys are have no idea how the amount of paper and backdrops I go through so this will be handy when I'm filming my YouTube videos and stuff like that because I could just throw it away and then the next item she sent to me hands down has to be the most special gift that I have ever received from anyone it is literally the most beautiful dapping dish that I have ever saw so it comes in this absolutely gorgeous um, purple presentation box with the beautiful floral print on it and when I opened it up I was literally blown away at first I was like what the hell is this and then when I saw it I was like oh my god it's one of those dapping dishes that come with the little crystal lids and I saw them all over the place and i just never really have went and bought one so i am absolutely over the moon with this guys you have no idea how much i was just like oh my god i can't believe she actually sent me one of these it is so beautiful and honestly one of the most beautiful sort of nail art tools that i've ever seen then next up she sent me one of these absolutely gorgeous blue chrome unicorn nail dusting brushes i was absolutely in love with this the second i saw it it will probably never get used simply because i will keep it for display purposes on my nail nook it is just freaking gorgeous and the blue is just right up my street so moving on guys and the next bag that I pulled out was a massive bunch of nail chromes and pigments and mermaid type stuff so I'll just dive in and show you what I got so first she sent me these gorgeous pink hollowed out um, stars then she sent me some gold foil and also some silver foil then we move on to the chrome sort of pigments and that kind of stuff this is from a brand i've never tried before so i'm so excited to give these a go so these are called shell powders i believe they are so i'm kind of assuming these are like a translucent powder that would give your gel polishes different sort of um effects so i got the purpley colored one there we also have a green one as well again i love the look of this one Next up, we have like a purpley blue sort of colour. Again, this one really in intrigues me. Probably one I would buy myself if I was out shopping for these. They are absolutely gorgeous. So this is the shell powders. Then we have the chrome sort of chameleon pigments. This one is one of those ones that sort of like shift from a purple to like a slightly green colour. Really, really beautiful. Next, we have one of their laser powders. This is basically a silver holographic powder and you guys will know from all of my nail art videos and stuff like that i very rarely use chrome powders and stuff but this is giving me total nail vibes i really am in love with every one of these i cannot wait to give them a go and i literally have not seen them before so i was absolutely over the moon then we have these ones that are also like um they're, they're called thousand foil so again i'm assuming they are more of like a, a translucent effect over the nail like a sort of like glass powder if that makes any sense then we have this gorgeous pink a thousand foil and then we have a gold one 
And to also in with the set, I got a set of instructions and stuff like that on how to use the powders and then a really gorgeous little pink and white kabuki brush to remove any excess dust. And moving on guys, I am in complete glitter heaven here. She absolutely spoiled me with some of the most gorgeous glitters. So the first set I got were these Fabian Mylar shards. And as you can see, there is the absolute rainbow on there. Lots of different colours. And then she sent me some sort of like glitter pieces or more larger sequins. And these I think would be fab to be mixed in with some of my DIY glitters. So you saw there that she sent a mixed bag of female canes. Then we have these gorgeous unicorns. They are quite large, but I think they would look epic encapsulated on the nail. Then we have some of these like flowers, seashells, little smiley faces. Basically a little mixed bag, again, that are perfect for encapsulating. Then we have some mixed holographic unicorns. Then next up, she also sent me a set of these black holographic unicorns. I freaking love these. I already have them in blue, so I'm so excited to have them in different colours. Then next up, we have this like pastel set of different shapes. I absolutely adore this one, guys. I think this one is going to look really, really beautiful encapsulated on a clear nail. Then we have a set of these sort of like Aurora shifty um, dolphins. So moving on guys, and the next set that she sent me were these seashell shapes. I am saying it like that simply because for the last five minutes I've been trying to say it without sounding like Sean Connery. So moving on from that one, we have these um, sort of like blue Aurora pips. I call them pips because that's what a, a Glitter calls them, but I'm not 100% sure what the actual term for them is. Then we have these pastel holographic and black holographic discs, which again look freaking awesome encapsulated in the nail. Then she also sent me this absolutely gorgeous set of nail foils with some flames and stuff like that on them they are absolutely gorgeous and finally guys glitter heaven gets just a little bit better she only has sent me this absolutely massive bundle of these sort of like chameleon flakes i'm not kidding when i tell you i cannot pick my favorite out of these every single one of them has a different color shift to them and they are absolutely freaking stunning so i have some similar glitters to this that are more like in other mixes so i am so 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 excited to finally have like pure flakes so i could just use these on their own or mix them in with my own glitter mixes if i so choose so to have like the choice of these um without other glitters is just freaking amazing to me i am so excited to try these like i said i can't tell you which one is my favorite there was that many to choose from and every single one of them are absolutely stunning and finally guys, that is us reached the end of this hell of a long video, but I really hope you guys enjoyed having a little nosy at everything the lovely Danielle sent me. And please, please remember to go and check out her channel, have a little nosy at everything I sent her, but check out her content mostly. She is such a lovely lady, she does amazing videos, and like I said, we are very, very similar when it comes to our tastes in nail art products, so if you like what I show, you will most definitely like what she does as well her channel is amazing and she definitely deserves far more subscribers than she currently has so definitely go and show her your support and tell her that you came from me and I just want to quickly finish off this video by saying a massive thank you to Danielle for doing this friend swap with me. I had such fun shopping for her and I am absolutely over the moon with every single item that she sent me. I am going to have hours and hours of fun playing with all of these new goodies and I am definitely over the moon to have her in my life and to have met her through this community. So yeah, definitely go and give her a shout out from me guys. And yeah, if you did enjoy today's video, please give me a thumbs up i would totally appreciate it and if you're new to my channel and you haven't already don't forget to click that subscribe button i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and as always to my returning subscribers i love you guys so much thank you for joining me today and i will see you in the next one bye